Good afternoon, YouTubers. T Square here with T Square Talk. So, as I said in previous videos, I am doubling down. Um, I've got strong, strong feelings that we are going to continue to see a beatdown uh, in silver for this month. However, uh, when financial quarter two ends on the first of the month, then I expect we're going to start to see a big rally. Um, I've got a few different ideas on how this is all going to play out, why this is going to play out. we got a package open. We're going to be busting opening today. If you guys did not see my previous video, uh, I recommend you guys go check it out. Uh, it's a lot of my opinion on what happened at the end of the financial quarter, uh, the most recent financial quarter uh, during January, February, and March. Uh, March, we've seen a horrible beatdown in silver. Some of you guys might remember it where actually silver dipped into the $20 range. Um, and then over the next 13 days, uh, we've seen it go from 20 to back up to 25 and change. Uh, almost a 25% jump. Why is that happen at the end of a financial quarter? I, I think a lot of shorts start to come due. And I think we're seeing the same thing for the second financial quarter for April, May, and June. So if you guys enjoyed this package opening video, please make sure you hit that subscribe button. Hit that thumbs up. Uh, I'm doubling down. I, I'm going to put my money now. And I know um, July, August, I might be a little broke um, because I'll have put so much in but that's okay i'd rather buy it now when i can get it a whole lot cheaper in my opinion than i'll be paying later um so let's bust this package open uh i apologize my setup's a little crowded today because i got so much stuff literally sitting here right now as it's a bunch of projects that i'm doing i actually got a bunch of capsules ready to put these uh some of these in capsules i know some people are gonna be like dude they're bullion ounces of silver why would you bother putting them in, in a capsule you're gonna see uh in just a minute why that is so i'm gonna i'm gonna show you guys up close once i get it uh actually opened up here let's see the best way to do this so i apologize for right now um the opening part of this, but this is, gonna, this is a really exciting set that I uh, recently had someone bring this to my attention, and I'm going to show you guys why. Are they bullion? Absolutely. They're just bullion coins, um, but it's a neat set, and I'm going to show you why here in about 30 seconds. I'm just making sure. I'm checking something real quick. Okay. So we got 100 ounces of silver here. All of these are the exact same ounces. Um, so let's get this opened up. For those of you guys that don't know, um, the previous story, I actually had a subscriber bring a series up to my attention about like the aliens over different cities and how the premiums on them have just drastically skyrocketed. And I was like, man, I wished I had gotten some early on, but I didn't. I didn't get any early on, and I just missed the boat on it. And now they're just too expensive to get. So the next limited set that I heard of, I said I wanted to get into. This set is from Silvertown. So Silvertown design, uh, makes these up, and I don't know if they – I guess they design them, they make them, whatever. I don't know. Um, but needless to say, there's not a ton of them. There's only – a hundred thousand of each coin. Now, I know some people are going to be like, that's bullion. It's nothing special. It's the Legendary Warriors set. So, let's see here. Let's do, okay. So, I'll show you guys. I'll show you guys the front because the back is going to be, I know someone's going to be like, dude, why are you touching them with your hands? You know, I, they are bullion. I'm touching them on the edge. Um, so, this is... Eric Bloodaxe. So he was a Viking. Some people might have uh, kind of heard a little bit about him from the Vikings, uh, the TV series, or, or I don't know if it's Discovery or what. But you can you can follow you can look him up actually on YouTube. It's a lot of videos because I'll be honest, I didn't really know who the guy was uh, until I read a little bit about his history. Uh, this is the Legendary Warrior set. Now here's the thing: this coin. Actually, or this round, I guess it's technically a round because it's not a coin. Um, but this round actually came out a while back. This is the first one in the series. 
Then they had the second one that came out, and actually the third one comes out next month. So when I had an opportunity to get a hundred of these, I said, oh man, I got to jump on this. Uh, it's around, so it's relatively inexpensive. However, as more people get into this set, and I'm going to tell you why they're going to get into this set, I believe, because they actually took the hero, or the legendary he heroes, or legendary warriors, I guess he's not really a hero, but he was a hero to some people, uh, the legendary warriors of different countries. Um, so the reason is when, when people from that country who really know who this is, uh, you know, this was their leader at one time, um, basically they're going to want them. And as more people get on them, once you get one, you're going to want to get the other one. I can't wait until, uh, some of the other big names, There's a lot of big names. This first one, like I said, Al, uh, Eric blood Axe. the next one after this was Julius Caesar. The one after that is Spartacus. And then there's a lot more big names. Uh, I wish I had the list of all the names um, that are going to be in it. Uh, Attila the Hun and, and all these different people from different regions of the world. There's even a uh, Native American from the United States um, that actually becomes one of the coins. So it's going to be pretty cool. I think as they start making more of these, they're going to have more people jump on this set. And it's going to be super popular now. So this is the front. When you turn the coin around or the round around, that just sounds weird, the round around. Um, it does have legendary warriors, uh, one ounce, 999 fine silver. Uh, it's the same backing. It's basically a weapons design of all the different weapons that they use. Um, everything from bow and arrows to uh, axes to swords to samurais to... You name it, knives, bow and arrow, whatever, whatever the warrior used back in their time. So a super awesome set. I know some people uh, might think, man, you are going crazy buying. And yes, I am. Uh, I really think that the big jump is going to happen the first few weeks of next month. We're going to see all of this beat down get erased. And I think we're going to continue to see a beat down um, in the meantime. And that's okay because I keep putting my orders. And I know some people that are friends with me, they ask, well, why are you ordering now when you know it's or you believe it's going to get even worse as the month goes on? Reason being, I don't want to totally miss out. So if I kind of diversify my purchases, yes, I'm dollar cost averaging down. However, I would not be surprised to see a few dollar, at least a five dollar jump in the first couple weeks of next month. And that may sound crazy to some people. A $5 jump. What are you, high? You go ahead and just watch. See what happens. Uh, this is gonna be, there's a lot of people right now that got to cover the shorts. The end of the quarter is almost here. It's a week away. Uh, today, at the time of shooting this video, it's the 21st. I may air this on the 22nd, 23rd. Um, time is ticking. I want to talk a little bit about uh, why I believe that silver is going to continue to get beat down for the remainder of the month in a video that I may air actually tomorrow, which will be yesterday for most of you that are watching this video. I had someone ask me, you know, do I air these the second I get the stuff? No, I don't always air it the second I get this stuff. However, I got a special video that I want to put up tomorrow, which is yesterday. So make sure you guys go and check it out. Uh, you know, it's just blatant proof on why I believe silver has to go higher. It can't stay down. As they try to cover their shorts, what they're essentially doing is they're trying to kick the can down the road. They know they can't cover all these shorts. So if they beat the price down as low as they can, essentially it makes it easier for them to cover them. And then nobody wants to take delivery. However, what I believe is going to happen this time is you're going to have a lot of countries and a lot of people like me and you that are going to be buying this dip buying this opportunity. They're going to be going in hard. They're going to be pushing, squeezing every penny they can because they know or they believe in the first couple weeks of next month, we're going to see a big jump. And that's my thought. So if it means I can't put any silver orders in next month, that's okay for me. Uh, in the long run, I'm in this for the long run. I might experience a little bit of short-term pain, but it's going to be for a long-term gain. 
So if you guys enjoyed this video, please make sure you hit that thumbs up button. Let me know what you guys think of this set. You can look this up. Um, Silvertown actually has them. Uh, you can find them if you look around on the internet. You might be able to find them. I get a little weary because there are potentially counterfeits out there. However, um, with only a hundred thousand of these made, I don't think there'll be a huge amount of counterfeits. However, you guys know I do have a Sigma, so I test every coin as you can see right there. Um, so I test every coin as soon as it comes in just to guarantee that I'm not going to get stuck holding the bag. I mean, I'll send it back right off the bat if something doesn't check out. I've actually heard people that have ordered um, coins online and they were fake and they discovered it and literally the people just, oh, just keep it. We'll refund you the money. Yeah, they know. They don't want to deal with the hassle. They don't want to deal any with any of the backlash, but there are fakes. Now, I'll be honest, a lot of these small online um, sellers online, obviously, um, they don't want any kind of backlash, and, and they are there are out there fakes. However, there might be someone like me that will would sell one or two here and there. If an opportunity comes up, I might have a friend that decides he wants to get into it after they've already got five or six out. You're not going to want to pay the premiums at that point. So I'm hoping to see the premiums on these really start to climb. And that's why I got a 100 of them. And I've already got a 100 of the second one on order. I haven't decided if I'm going to pre-order the third one because I hate pre-ordering silver and then having to wait before they will even look at it, your order. I mean, you know, because it's not supposed the third one ain't supposed to come out until like the uh, second week of next month, I believe. So we'll see what happens on that. Please, if you guys enjoyed the video, hit the thumbs up button. Leave me a comment. Hit that subscribe button. It helps out the channel more than you know. Um, and keep stacking, my friends. Uh, none of this is financial advice. It's just my opinion of stuff and how stuff is going to play out. And I'm, I'm going in for the long term. Uh, I think I'm going to be rewarded later. Um, this, this may seem painful for some people. I've got some friends that they bought in. They're a little frustrated right now because they seen a, a you know, essentially a two, three dollar drop more recently. Um, and the pain could continue on, but it's a short term thing. Uh, I think the pain will only be for a little bit. Short term pain for long term gain. I love that saying. I don't know how I just, sitting there thinking about it came up. So with that being said, thank you all for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. And I'm going to get some of these slapped in these capsules and go from there. So thank you all for watching. Y'all have a great one. Take care, everybody. Bye-bye.